everyone, this is Fabian Renee. I am back with movie reviews by Fabian Renee. With Fabian Renee, how would you like it? <laughs> um, first one this year is If Bill Street Could Talk. I'm really sorry. I, I think I apologize a couple of times. I'm late. I saw it early, but at the end of the year, the, all the things I had to do, and with the beginning of the new year, I was really, really busy. Happy New Year. Hey, everybody. This is Faye Renee. I am back. First movie review for 2019. Can you believe it's 2019? Time really flies. Are you having fun? <laughs> anyway, I am back from the theater. I'm back and I'm black. Okay? I just got back from seeing Beale Street. I ain't taking my wraps off, as you can see, okay? Um... <laughs> Don't let me go see these black-oriented, beautiful family setting, yet socially conscious and socially aware movies. Bill Street? Okay. I will really be back. And yes, I am black. <laughs> Bye. In a minute. Anyway, um, as you probably already know from all the media hype, it's the Shiksa. It is. Uh, starring Regina King, and it's a, a great movie that takes place in uh, any city, urban America, and it's that, you know, that black urban tale, you know, that uh, movie that, you know, will kind of wake you up, make you a little more socially conscious and politically aware of just how discriminatory things are. So you have to be in the mood for it. Uh, I liked it a lot. And I think the acting was really good by everyone involved. But I do think that The Hate You Get was a better movie. But uh, it, it, I think, I don't know why, but it feels like they wanted it to be PC. And this one is getting more hype than The Hate You Give. Well, just look at the name. The Hate You Give is a little bit more militant. But uh, it was on point. They both were. Uh, so I'm just making this short. Go see it. You already know it's good. It's a four out of five. You know, I'm a five-star system. Uh, four means go see it. It's a uh, credit worthy, Oscar worthy, even if it doesn't get any because Oscar sucks. You know, we're not looking to play the Oscar. We're playing the us. So uh, if you want to see a really good movie, go see Bill Street. Um, for instance, it's been nominated for three Golden Globe Awards. And that includes Best Picture, Drama, uh, best Picture Drama, Best Supporting Actress for King, of course, and Best Screenplay. And it's at the 24th Critics' Choice Awards. It received five nominations. They're not playing. Very engrossing film. And um, dealing with today's issues that are hundreds of years old, really. Best Adapted Screenplay, Best Supporting Actress. Tons and tons of accolades and awards are coming this way for this film. So, Bill Street and The Hate You Give, both of them are on point. Almost in the same genre, you know? Hey, everybody. Uh, I'm back again. Listen, so, I was so late with Bill Street, I'm sorry. I, I saw it early, but I never got to finish the review. So now I'm finding out they have, in fact, won many, many awards. I knew they would. They, they, I, they won a lot. Um, I just get this off the press. I just came back from the gym, guys. I'm getting buff. <laughs> okay. Um, so far, Bill Street has won the Golden Globe Award for Best Supporting Actress. My girl, Regina King. I knew that. I thought she was the best actor in the movie, as I said. Satellite Award for Best Actress, Regina King again. The National Society for Film Critics Award, Regina King again. Oh my God, and the New York Film Critics Circle Award, Best Actress, my girl, Regina King. So, I think Bill Street does move quite slow, but I loved it. I still think as far as, oh, the black movie that should win or the other, if they're doing that, because Oscars and all of them are quite... I don't want to call them racist, but they're, they're not fair, okay, when it comes to black folks, so we would have won a long time ago. But they're very political. And I'll say this, I think The Hate You Give is a better movie than Bill Street. But I think Bill Street is a story they want to hear. So that's politics. But next time it's favorite day, I'll catch you again at the movies. Bye! <laughs> of note, 
Beale Street was directed by Barry Jenkins. It starred Kiki Lane and Stephen James as the star-crossed lovers set in the 60s, and it's based on a novel of same name by James Baldwin. Four stars.